Hey hello guys welcome back my name is Sagar Prajapati and in this video I will be solving another question of Python which was asked in the recent interview. So I got this question from a LinkedIn post or LinkedIn feed so I thought to share with you guys right. So chalo, let's get started apart from this you know I would like to introduce my course that is based on Python. So if you are someone who wants to learn Python in deep then I would suggest to check out this course master in Python with data structure and algorithm I will give the link in my description box okay so you can see you know uh, total 231 students have been enrolled in this course and you know uh, all these other content so if you want to just watch the you know watch the first video then you can watch it without you know logging into this uh, uh, you know course right and you can see total 20 hours of 21 hours of content is available you can see basic of python is present pre request for data structures problem solving skills and then real time scenario framework in data engineering which we oftenly use right so all these things you know present over here so if you want to just learn it then you can check out this course if you wish you can enroll into it so let's get back to the course so not course sorry the you know the question the question saying that we have an input list and this is the output so what does it mean that you can see the input list giving like one two then we have one another list okay we have this uh, uh, the, we have this nested list inside this nested list also we have one nested list right likewise you know we have another nested list so we have to flatten a kind of you know we have to flatten this all these lists right so you can see the output would be like 1 2 7 9 15 12 9 18 and 10 so on right so you know, let's get started how we can solve this problem so what i'll do i'll just create a function called f underscore flatten something like that you know you you you, you can give any function name right and now what it will take it, it will take it will take the input list so i'll just write like this after that you know what i need to do good question so, so you know i will create a empty list of this and then what i'll do i'll just write here for i in l not n l it should be input underscore list correct now what i will do i will first check it the see we are using for i in input list so if you know python then you know what does it do right so it will take the element one by one so first time one will go so one is a integer so i will just put it into a new list okay i mean new list right likewise two now when it check that hey when it comes to here it will it will actually identify as a list right so i will check if type of type of i is list if it is list then for now you know for time being i will not do anything else if it is an integer right so we are assuming that we receive an integer maybe we receive a string or whatever so so right so here i will append the things correct and now append of i let me just you know write like this and return the l for time being and now what i'll do i'll just print and call this function f underscore flatten and here i will you know pass this input underscore list right let me just run this you will see we receive the output one two because why we did not receive this output because it is it it is a list kind of right so here we have to pass something else so i will just write here l dot x we cannot do append otherwise there will be a duplicacy so i will use here as extend and then what i need to do i need to again call the same function so i will just call the same function and here i will pass the i so if i run this now you will see we have the uh, dedicated output right now why i have passed this so you can assume that you know first time in the first iteration one will go one one is gone right then second is gone then when it comes to seven then it will check that hey type of i is list correct that it will go over here then it will go over here and it will check that f flatten it will call the same function f flatten of i it means the value will be like seven only again it will go here and it will it will start okay it will start so you can see uh, again it will go here and then it will start the stuff so it will go here seven right now seven now seven is a kind of integer now right so it will put here integer 
right then 9 then again it will go like this so if you know python then maybe you you are able to you know cope up if you do not know then maybe sorry like you know then you you should know all this stuff what is list you know how to do iteration and so that's why i just told you that if you are beginner if you do not know python then check out those course it will definitely help you because you know that course is dedicated for the data engineers as well as for the software engineers also so for someone who is watching this video who wants to be a data engineer then definitely check out those course it will actually help you okay so chalo, let's let's stop this video over here and i hope that you have got this uh, question and if you if you you can also you know ping or you, do, you can also comment down with your solution so that you know it will be useful for everyone not to me see i i got the solution from my linkedin post so maybe you you know better than me so you can also post it okay and i believe that we can also solve this question via while loop also so you can just try it out if it works then well and good otherwise you know we are good to go so thank you bye bye we'll meet you in the next lecture